Welcome back, Fall Sports. Dury Volleyball wrapping up the fourth of four games of the La Quinta Kickoff Classic Tournament in O'Reilly. DU opening with a win over St. Cloud State, then dropping a couple to Union and Northern State, so they look to rebound as they host Lindenwood out of St. Louis. Ashley Fitzgerald's club dealing with injuries as has typically been the case to start the season, but showing no ill effects. The freshman Kaylee Cole lays one down, bring the pain, young one. DU up 8-6 early. Lindenwood keeping it within reach. Ball comes just back over the net off the dig, and Kayla Guyot is there with the kill to make it 14-12, Drew. Laney Timmons beasted all over this game. Led Drury in both kills 15 and blocks 6. There's one of them. Too much power from the Panthers in the first set. Another new face, Chloe Foster with the boom. DU goes on to take the first set 25-21. In the second, more of the same. Alexis Dutch sneaks it over for the set clinching point 25-18. She finished with 44 assists. Kerry Kuzumanu not happy on the Lions bench. In between sets, Panther basketball for Cameron Adams, perhaps courting one of the Lion volleyball players. I believe she was uninterested. On to the third set now. The Lions trying to regroup. They come out aggressive and they're putting on a block party. Even getting a few lucky bounces, Anna Reichert serve, clips the net and falls over for the ace. Panthers come on late in the set but to get it within two, but the Lions doing just enough to force a fourth set. DU comes on strong. Two straight service aces from Little Boom, Kaylee Cole for points 23 and 24, and then it's Sarah Borneman. She puts the finishing touches on it. She had 14 kills in this one. DU downs Lindenwood 3-1 to one and finishes the tournament out at 2-2. Two two. They're back in action on Friday in Sioux Falls, South Dakota at the NSIC Challenge. We definitely went into the weekend thinking that we were going to go 4-0, and, and so that first loss last night was really a, it was really a hard blow. But, um, you know, I think we really came back from that this evening, and it was a must win, and we got it done. I think our, our serve and pass was really good, and we took some major steps in uh, being really diverse on offense and on utilizing our middles and transition. I thought Chloe and Lane did an excellent job tonight, and Lex did much better distributing the ball. But we, we've got an awful lot of young kids out there. You know, a lot of times on the court, there's four kids who don't have any playing experience here. So um, it's really positive to get them all together, and, and I think we made strides through the weekend.